What's up YouTube, it's Danny, back with another video. Today, I am doing a Korean food haul. So yesterday, my friend Kayla, as you all are aware of, um, she's my friend, you know, she's been in my videos. She invited me to go to the Korean market, to a new one I've never been to, in Oakland Park. I said, sure, let's go. So, it's really hard for me to say, you know, no to Korean markets, because I love Asian food a lot. Um, Big thanks to Kayla who actually got me liking it more than I already did before I knew her. So I've got all kinds of stuff, all kinds of crazy stuff to try out. A lot of dry stuff. Um, I will say that this video is gonna have jump cuts because I'm not gonna be eat, I'm not gonna eat everything at once. I'm gonna go through all the frozen or not frozen, but all the cold stuff after I go through all the regular snacks. So let me get in frame because I realized I really wasn't in frame just now. First up, we got Korean. Cheetos. So, uh, I think they're just regular Cheetos, but everything is in Korean, which I think is dope, honestly. And then I had to pick up this just because of the name Chinese Restaurant Tea. This is all the Korean market. $1.99, you get like 16 bags of Chinese Restaurant Tea. Okay, next up, I've already had a bag of these, so. Uh, but the sea snack, which is seaweed, wasabi flavored, delicious, I ate the whole thing. Very oily, I think it's just the way that snack is. I got the uh, Haichu Fizzies flavor. So it tastes like Coca-Cola or some form of cola. And I've got, I'm excited for this. This is rice cakes, but like spicy rice cakes. So rice cakes in a sauce, it looks like. That's gonna be interesting. That's probably gonna be delicious. What else do I have in here? Oh, I did, I bought two of these. I'll just show one though. Uh, Ichiban shrimp flavored ramen, always good. I've had Ichiban before. This was on clearance. It's Prince brand and they are little Prince brand snacks. I don't know if they're noodle snacks. They might be, so. Yeah, we will be trying everything, obviously. Like, like I said before though, if you see me wearing different shirts throughout the video, it's because it's either a different time of day or a different day altogether. So, that being said, there's all of those snacks. Hopefully I didn't forget anything. I think I covered everything there. Now to the cold stuff. So this is fish. What kind of fish? I forget what it said. But it's, it's, uh, it's fish that's been like, cut up into strips, so, and then sauteed, and yeah, eat cold. So there's that. Um, this one sketched out Kayla. These are fish cakes, but they're like in the shape of a hot dog. Uh, kids favorite, so it's gotta be good. I would think they would be delicious, so we'll find out. Um, and then I got a premium drink. It's called Sack Sack Orange. So no idea. What that's gonna be like. Let's see if I can get the focus. There you go. Sack sack orange. It's in a small can. So probably some orange drink. Um the main course for today's lunch though is going to be the it's called Gimbob, which looks like sushi. So Kayla says it's not her favorite. It's like a it's like a sweet tasting sushi. I'm looking forward to it though. So we will be opening up that one shortly. Uh, and then I've got two things here of carbonated milk. One is strawberry. Sounds weird. And then one is just regular flavored milk. Uh, what I find interesting is you've got you know Snoopy on the front of these. So, I don't know if they have a uh, partnership with uh, the Peanuts franchise. Yeah, Peanuts Worldwide. So this is made by Peanuts. So they make stuff in Korea, that's cool. So yeah, that is on today's agenda. I think first I want to try the fish that's like strips. Fish strips? I don't know what to do. Ooh, it's got a sweet smell. So, 
So yeah, these are just strips of fish. There you go. Mmm, that's good. Yep, it tastes like fish, but it's like sweet. With a little kick to it, that's good. I figured it would be. Mmm, 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 mmm. Yeah. Got a savory, sweet, spicy taste. I'm digging that. That's amazing what, what cultures can come up with. That is so good. I'll be saving that for later. Mm. Mm. It's like a spicy sesame, something like that. So, yeah. Definitely digging that. Let me zoom in so I don't have to lean so far ahead. Sorry about that. Should have done that in the beginning. But yeah, in case you didn't get a good look. Delish, very delish. It's just like fish and strips, you know? It's, and then the marinated, ooh, that's so good. That was $4, that's actually not bad price, but that is delicious, okay. Let's try the the gimbab. I'm just gonna tear right here. All right, gimbab. Yeah, it feels like sushi. It definitely feels like it. So this is gimbab, <coughs> made fresh yesterday. I saw them make it, and then I picked up one and focus on the gimbab and not me. There we go. Very cool. That'll be the thumbnail. Why not? Mmm, mmm, mm-hmm. Taylor, why do you not like this? This is so good. This is insanely good. Mmm. This is beautiful. Kayla, you're tripping. She said she wasn't a big fan of the gimbab. I don't know why. It's got spinach, carrots, Pickled radish, gourd strip, fish cake, rice, egg, and sesame oil. So good. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. This is amazing. Can you strip it? Sorry. I don't feel my mouth. Mmm. There, if you want to see a close look at it again. That's gimbab. Oh, so, so good. Maybe that'll be the thumbnail. I think that's gonna be the thumbnail. You can see me and the gimbab. That'll work. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm, I'm gonna, ooh, I'm gonna devour that later on. That is good. Oh my goodness. All right, time for the sketchy hot dog fish thingies. Oh, they got pre wrapped. Yeah. <laughs> That's not be interesting. Alright. If I don't like these, then I don't like them. But I feel like I'm going to like just about everything I've bought. That doesn't. That does not look appetizing. But I've, <laughs> I've got the hot dog fish open. There you go. Smoker. Mmm, yummy. Hot dog fish. Mel, I know you're probably watching. You're probably not enjoying this segment. Or maybe this video as a whole, but here we go. Hot dog fish, cheers. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> that is really good. It tastes like fish in a hot dog form. I love Asia. I just love all of Asia because this food is this is stuff we don't get here normally. Oh. Okay, so now that lunch is done, I ate the rest of that. It, it, the Korean sushi, I forget, is it gimbab? I think is what it's called. I don't know why Kayla don't like this. It, she tripping, it was, it was delicious. I devoured the rest of it. Um, so I am thirsty. I'm gonna try the sack sack orange now on camera. I need it to focus on it and not my face. Come on, Cannon. All right, so the sack sack orange drink and I'm gonna try one of these rice 
or these noodle snacks, whatever they are. So, popping open the Sack Sack Orange. I'm expecting like Kool-Aid taste. It smells orangey. So, here goes nothing. I don't know why my camera's getting, I think it's the white balance or something. It keeps getting dark. Mmm, yeah, yeah. That's kind of what I expected. It's, it, it's like a Kool-Aid. With pulp. I actually like pulp in my orange juice, so this drink is not only really delicious, it's refreshing. So it's like a, it tastes like a Kool-Aid kind of, but it's, it's definitely orange and the pulp of an orange is definitely in it. I will be back for more of that. That is amazing. Man, this food is amazing. All right, the little noodle snack thing. Just gonna open it up like that. Yeah, it's just little noodles. Very good. It's like little, like little noodles. Like a, kind of a sweet, kind of a savory taste. Kind of salty, really, really good. I know what's causing my camera to do that. It's my screen. All right. Sorry about that, guys. When the cannon sees a, a like a white screen, it like dims the whole area. So sorry about that. Yo, real quick, I almost forgot to record me trying these. I did try one, unfortunately, off camera. But I do want to say that these are Cheetos from Korea. And at, while I can't read Korean, uh, it looks like it's pepper and onion flavored, and it definitely tastes like pepper and onion flavored. Let me just. Show you real quick. It just looks like a regular orange Cheeto. It's probably not gonna focus. It's focusing on the bag. Mmm. Yep, it's sweet and spicy. So you have the cheese flavor, obviously, the Cheeto cheese flavor with sweet onion and spicy, just a little spicy, uh, pepper. Really good. Really good. And I got that in the bag. Just trying. There we go. Sweet onion and peppers and cheese. Very good. Very good indeed. Mmm. Okay. Um, probably watching David play on Twitch. Anyway. I'm hungry. It's time for Din Din. I'm gonna eat these rice cake, spicy rice cake things. Or I think it's spicy. It might be teriyaki. <laughs> Only though it says hot, it's peppers. Okay, so yeah. Before I do that though, I wanted to show you uh, what they look like on the inside. So just gonna pop open the lid. And we've got a bunch of stuff. This Dave in the background talking. So here's all the little rice cakes. And I think that's the chili powder or some sort of powder powder back there. It's kind of hard to see on that side. Right there. Yeah, all these little rice cakes. And then the soup part is in this bag. So yeah. We'll go ahead and go ahead and go cook all of that. And uh, we will be right back. So stay tuned. Also, real quick, I realized that is not chili powder. That is that Selga stuff. This is do not eat. Neither <laughs> said what the fuck did you just fucking say about me, you little bitch. Anyway, you know whatever. Graduated top of my class. Okay, I've got the soup made, and I'm just gonna get a rice cake. And I gotta fish it up. So without dripping it all over my brand new mouse pad. There it is. It's probably gonna focus in my face, but here we go. Mmm, it's good. Tastes like a rice cake. And uh, yeah, a little bit of spice in the soup, not too bad though. Granted, there didn't seem like there was that much spice. Let me try just the broth. Mmm. 
Got a little kick to it, but it's more savory. That is a really good soup. Okay, so to end this very long video of the Korean market overhaul or haul, not overhaul. Um, I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna tread the the uh, ramen noodles just because they're ramen noodles. Um, I did try the Haichu candies, really good. Tastes like orange soda and tastes like Coca Cola. So that's those were the two flavors in the bag. But the last thing I wanted to try that's on camera are the latte or loti carbonated milk drinks. So I'm gonna start with the strawberry one. Does it say shake well? No caffeine, no preservatives. I'm not gonna shake well because I don't know if you're supposed to. So carbonated milk has me smells really good. It has me skeptical. So here we go. This is uh, from Lotte, Latte, whatever. Milk, and it's not wanting to, there we go. Strawberry milk, or strawberry drink. It's, it's got milk in it. It smells amazing. It smells really good, so here we go. Cheers, no more stalling. That's amazing. I don't know if there's milk in this or not. It doesn't taste like there is. It, it tastes like a strawberry drink. Strawberry carbonated drink. There is. Powdered skim milk is in, milk is in this? I don't, um, it's good. It, I can maybe taste a hint of what would be considered milk. But it's, wow. That's good. This one has me a little skeptical because this one is strawberry flavored. This is milk and yogurt flavored. And it's also carbonated, so it's, it's I don't know. I'm kind of, Okay, that has a dairy smell. I ain't too sure about this one. I left a little bit in this, in case I don't like this, so. Here we go, cheers. It's aimed at kids, so it's gotta be good. Oh, it is good. That tastes like, it tastes like 7-Up. Right, you can taste the yogurt. What would be a yogurt taste? I like. Why do I like this so well? It tastes like it tastes like a, a mix between Seven Up and Mountain Dew. Weird. Wow. Well, there you have it. That's a really good drink. I actually have that one. I like that one more than the strawberry, and I thought it was gonna be the other way around. So there you guys go. There's some definitely different flavors, different tastes, different kinds of foods in this haul. I'm happy to say I liked everything I bought. Everything I bought. I haven't tried the ramen, but it's ramen. I've had the ramen before, so won't be trying that on film. No need to. I already know what it tastes like. That being said, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you all in the next video. If you like these Korean market hauls, let me know. I'll keep doing more of them. So I know me and Kayla go to the market all the time. So hopefully we'll be going more uh, than we already do. So thanks for watching. Oh, one other thing. I don't know if I showed this already. I did buy one of those cat waving things, which is pretty cool. So, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. See you all in the next video. The cat's waving. Bye. Peace.